my name is Rhapsody, and welcome back to Griplands. All right. What missions were I even doing at the moment? Oh, I gotta get a new mission from you. There we go. Can't believe our luck. You know, at first I thought you were likely to, uh, you were as likely to sabotage as help me. But desperate times call for desperate measures, and so far, you're a ray of hope. It's not like I, uh, it's not like you to speak so optimistically, Calandra. I'll take it as a compliment. Good, because that's how I meant it. It'll take another miracle for me to repeat it. Thanks to you and those boggers, we got a chance to end the Baron's Hall wall for, all, uh, one, for, 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 for once and all. Or at least, end their tyranny. Uh, two wash knows with the same salt lick, I'd take it. Got it in one. But what we need is for Felmo to follow your lead. Time to melt your old war buddy for all he's worth, right? Whatever you gotta do to make sure you're his loyal friend, do it. All the workers under me would gladly die for the cause. A small sacrifice if freedom is, uh, if it meant freedom for us all. That's quite the commitment. We sign contracts uh, that'll follow us to our graves. If not see us all there even sooner, none of us is afraid of permanence. You recognize the colors of the member of the Rise, uh, boldly out and about on the main rows. You a grifter, stranger? Under contract, model? I'm gonna pretend I don't know, because this could easily be a second turncoat. The Rise? Is that a motivational group? Or a banking technique, perhaps? Motivational, sure. We're a workers' rights movement. You heard of the insurrection of the Bradfields? Were the laborers striked against the Admiralty occupation? Yeah, that does sound familiar. That was the rise! Now we're in Grout Park, trying to do the same against the Spark Bounds. Fair pay for good work. No demerits, no bottomless contracts. Of course, the overhead is killer. We need money to keep operating, and our own members are lacking. You want some literature? For a small fee, I mean. Rise Manifesto. Opponent gains five indoctrination. When dismissed, gain one dominance per stack. At the end of each turn, gain one influence and reduce this argument by one. Sounds good to me. Very well, let's see this literature. Hopefully it might answer any questions you have. Be careful who might see you with it, though. Kigin continues down the road, leaving you to your reading. Yeah, I wonder if that'll, like, signal to people if I play it in combat. Like, I'm a member of the Rise. So I might not want to play it in, like, Admiralty fights and stuff like that. Where are the deepest trenches of you be? I've heard numerous reports of the Rise having some lead on the boggers, but nothing has come to me. Surely you must have something. Can't say I've heard anything of the sort. I'm sorry to disappoint. Nipsis! Well, I'll keep your ear to the ground, and if you want anything, tell me. Idle hands become slippery tentacles, as they say. What do you have to keep a fellow my skill uh, occupied, lest the tides catch me up in their whims? There's always something. Let me look through the nice reports. Uh, rescue a baron from a rise trial, or investigate a crime scene for the barons. This one's less money, but it seems less likely that I have to encounter and possibly kill Rise. Ah, you should find this one interesting. So, <laughs> should remind you of the front lines, I imagine. It seems the Rise have gotten hold of some explosives. Do you know where they plan to use them? Blam, <laughs> they've already been used. The ingrates blew up one of the workers' dormitories. They blew up their own housing. Why? <laughs> Perhaps to make a point. Smart parents uh, sweep the bugs during the shifts to ensure that no one is smuggling out any relics. Unfortunately, the bombs went off too early. <laughs> the medicine was killing a couple of their own smugglers. Good luck aside, when you don't see this opportunity, it will have on the rise. Find out who's responsible, or at least who could believe will be held responsible. We need a suitable use for their <laughs> disciplinary hearings. Alright. Let's go to the crime scene. You find Frash flanked by security and berating a trio of unfortunate civilians. The lot of you are hiding something, and if I have to whip it out of you. Excuse me. Who in hash are you? Oh, you're Felimo's pet grifter, is that right? I was told I should expect your meddling. Oh, I assure you, I'll keep my meddling to a minimum. What exactly happened here? The Rise blew up the dorm here. I'm a 
aware of that much, thank you. I was uh, interested in greater context. It's hot here. Greater context? The Rise are anarch uh, anarchic miscreants. They stole a bomb. They used it. They were even dumb enough to blow up some that I own. Dumb enough or clever enough? Huh? Who are the suspects? Pass Lock is a worker who lives in the pod. He was late for the shift the day uh, before the explosion. Probably getting uh, spent the time getting the explosives. Erbler works in the deep bog and has been seen loitering in the area. No doubt stouting out opportunities for vandalism. Finally, Dell is the foreman of the local pit. You'd think he'd know who butters his bread, but he doesn't bet quota or quarter. I'd bet real shields that he's letting the rise buddies shirk and organize. You seem pretty convinced they're all guilty. Everybody's guilty of something. I'm gonna talk to the suspects. Find out which one did it, and we can take the next step. Hey, Paslo! Rick, I'm so glad you're here. You have to save me. Do you, what do you know about the bombing? You know me, Rook. I didn't do anything. Why are you always late for your shifts? Is, why is anybody late for their shifts? I work at the bottom of a stinking hole, and I barely make more than I spend on food. I'll interrogate. Perhaps with our powers combined, we can solve this, huh? Quickly prepare boosted jargon. That'll gamble three times, reducing the cost of all the stuff in his hands. Okay. I mean, tall dog, it is more damage. Okay. Uh, set so points ahead, definitely. I want to get rid of this blacklisted as soon as possible. It's going to make me discard, like, important cards commonly. Double the damage to this card and gamble? Hell yeah. Uh, got him. I'll place the top three cards in the draw pile. Uh, got to prepare a card here. Uh, don't really matter. Zero damage, nice work. There we go. We already got this one. Uh uh, don't need any of those. Yeah. There wasn't me, Pop. It, it, it went still, I saw him do it. Right, crash. Well, Grifter, have you figured it out with your superior intellect? I'm going to talk to the Airbler, actually. If you're going to question me, I'm going to just tell you the same thing I told the other guy. What do you know about the bombing? How should I know? I just work here. You live here. Why have you been loitering? You don't live here, brother. I have friends in the pod. We're allowed to have friends, right? All right, let's get to the bottom of this. Uh, stoic. Gain one composure at the start of battle. Damage spills over to this argument before the core argument. Neat. Okay. I'm going to rig ahead. So that I can gamble with good defense. Draw card. Really? Yikes. Bad cards that turn. I had brain gills again! Dang it! I'll use brain gills on headbang. That's that's fine, actually. Okay. Definitely gonna wanna use that to get rid of that and prepare the boost of jargon. Should have done that earlier, honestly. me unfortunately I'm gonna take two damage this turn as a result of that it's fine 
fine. Thank you for setting up my visionary bluff. Nice, that didn't even damage me, I don't think. even know what I'm preparing here. Close you though. And the voice of the people will take the enemy out this turn. Unless they somehow defend. That's fine. Headbang got upgraded to gamble twice. Yeah, more gambling is more good for us. Let's split gamble, deal four damage to all enemy arguments. This gives us actually like an AoE. We have no AoE yet. <laughs> it wasn't me, but it was Dell. I saw him do it. What? Hang on. What? You got any more questions for me? What do you know about the bombing? How would I know? I just work here. How do I know? How do I know? I just wait, yeah. Capisha. You haven't met your quota lately, yeah? It sounds something the like what the rise would like. You control? I, I just want people to like me. Is that a claim? Depends on the people, I guess. Alright, let's get to the bottom of this. Rig to prepare, prepare the tall dogged, use the tall dogged to prepare boosted jargon. Then all brain gills. Excess damage doesn't go. Uh, I'm about to take a bunch of excess damage here unless I use the crown royale. I really wanted a head split there. I shouldn't have crown guilds. That's my bad. I'm glad I didn't play Flower yet. Otherwise, I would have uh, gotten rid of my Admiralty until already. Okay. Hmm. Gamble two more times here easily. Then even boosted Headbang. Boosted Dilemma. Emma. And compose. Let that finish off by itself. Pay as many cards as possible. Um, fine, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I did. I do it again. Well, Grifter, have you figured it out with your superior intellect? Well, I tell him about the confession, I guess. We have our bomber inspector. Dell did it. Dell, are you sure? Quite. Huh? I wouldn't have guessed that. But if it ever turns out you're wrong, at least you'll be explaining that to Felimo. So we done. Huh? Done. You know, you've got to escort them to the interrogation site for questioning. Have fun. I'll probably try and let them go while I'm going across here. Seems like the idea. You get the sense you're being followed. All right, Grifter. Hand over Dell and we'll let you walk away. If you don't, then I'll have to kill you. It's just the way it is. Hand over Dell. Or defend myself. I am trying to work for the rise here, but like, I can't raise suspicion about myself right now. It's 
I'm gonna defend myself, I guess. Indeed, you'll have to kill me. I suspect you won't get very far. Oof, you've only got like four points that you can actually panic on. That's gonna be rough. <laughs> I'm losing my dog. All right, yeah, that makes sense. Of course, I'm losing my dog. Summon a feral auto dog to help us out here. Who is also going to die this turn? <laughs> All right. I should get rid of Cobblebot Flip early. There you go, both my dogs. Okay. When this is drawn, gain two cripple and draw two cards. So I'm losing damage now. They did draw two cards. I'm playing Induction Crank. Loaded Blast for a little bit of damage there. I thought it was going to be a little bit more than that. It's fine. Target you, I guess. Uh, play Bog Brain out. You know what? I'll get a combat drone. Sure. This fight does look like it's going to be pretty bad. Cards are no longer discarded at the end of your turn. Reduced by one each. Nice. Okay. Uh... Let's just get rid of you. Gotta defend myself where I can there. No, 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 I'm not trying to run away. extra cards also gives us a bunch of extra energy back so i have the ability to do things like gunsmoke now i really don't have any defense in this deck wow i'm just using charge gain as the way that i defend which is like certainly a way to do it don't think it's maybe the best way when destroy deals 17 damage to all fighters on the same team Yikes. So my goal right now is defend as best as I can. There's a bunch of wound on you. And shovel for my own defense. Then I'll remove some uh, some charges for my own defense as well. Okay. Hmm. I actually need to be weaker if I don't want to kill the enemy here. This might give me something. Yeah, that'll do it. 
So wait, it's got a range of six to eight, this does. Maybe I should just try and defend and like wait for a later turn. What are my next cards coming up? Loaded Blast when the enemy is not as weak. I think I, think I will wait actually. Wish I could play ready this turn also though. Five to nine. Dang it! Five, six, and seven wouldn't have killed there. When you murder a member of the rise, lose two max resolve. Dang it. Uh, RPG hits all targets, expend, destroy up to two uses. Neat. Overloaded course. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good for us. Hunker down, gets upgraded. Really wanted this to be a upgrade that also. Ooh, yeah, Fenheim Roast are really good for us. We have a lot of charge gain and a lot of charge expenditure. I'm just gonna let him go. It was their fault for being so sturdy and not panicking. You approach the gate. Felomo is waiting for you. But I assume you have a terrorist. Indeed, believe it or not. <laughs> and the mother. We're gonna escort them to the spike mining operation over at night spot. Teach them how to harvest and sell them at the market to the derricks. No. No, I can't. No. I got a family in Havaria. It can't. Turns out they very much can. And... What about payment? Surely only one good turn. I'm not right, of course. Here you go. You get 175 shills and a battle. At the start of each combat, nigga, yeah. Start of each uh, negotiation, rather. Uh, rig two heads. Love it. Whenever you spend your last charge to a card. Oh, I do that commonly, actually. Because I, I have a lot of things that expend all of my charge. That's a lot of draw. We rig heads easily already. I'm going to take the clicker. Uh, Krog wants to join you. Krog is looking for something to do if you need helpful company, as well as healing supplies to heal myself. I'm gonna get Krog. Go on, Krog. You find Krog's hovel amidst the sprawl. Krog is happy to see you. Krog, just the hunter I wanted to see. I'm bored and you always keep things entertaining. You need any help with anything? Always happy to have you along, Krog. <laughs> Great, just uh... Don't get me killed? No, oh, no promises. <laughs> In the world. I wasn't kidding. Alright. Wrong time for you to see where I really work. Confounded. Problems? I've chased every rumor that is supposed mugger cash, and I seem to go up like so much swamp gas. Perhaps they were just rumors then. No, so it would be so easy to be. Philemo turns to you, his expression shrouded. Night has fallen, so Kalantra should be ready to deal with the Bogger Cash, report to them, and then find out what they decided to do. Are you ready? Y'all ready? I'm ready. Alright. This would be dangerous, even now the job is done. Once you meet with the boggers, everyone in the bog is going to know where they uh, lay their heads. So I'm going to send you up with uh, backup, a couple bot sort. That way we can wipe the memories after so no one becomes a target. Except me, of course. Except you, but that's exactly why you're paid. The bogger raid, the bogger raid. So there's the Rise Tinker Shop. And then this one. What brings you back? Kalandra sent me. I'm here to suppo I'm supposed to pick up some backup. Is that so? I don't have many to spare. I could give you a single dog, a gobble dog. I'm on an important mission for Kalandra. Surely you can spare a bit more. I'm gonna go Soul Dogged to get Boosted Jargon in the front of the hand, and then it'll play a Boosted Gab for me. 
the idea just being that would eventually defend me. And it did. At the start of each turn, a random hand in uh, a random card in hand costs one extra this negotiation. This whole negotiation? That sucks. Dang it. Visionary bluff is important. Admiralty Intel, I don't think it's essential here. It still costs zero though, the Visionary Bluff, when it's uh when it works like that. Beautiful. How much of that? Motor trickery for uh, two bonus actions next turn. I think. Hopefully, there's some more draw in that deck. Boosted dilemma costs way too much. Thank you, divisionary bluff, though. Flower to play the top three cards in my draw pile. It might destroy the Rise Manifesto. I'm fine with that. And there goes the Manifesto. Stutter, play your next card twice, gain two vulnerability and lose four resolve. I can brain gills that actually. Uh, choosing a card to prepare that doesn't actually matter. I don't know if the brain gills effect is up. I hope it is. A double headbang. Get him. Got him. Fine, take a couple, but two. I think I will enjoy your company. Here we go! A whole army worth of people. You arrive at the bog hideout, but your handlers had reason to believe the boggers would appreciate the direct approach. Instead of sneaking in, you walk right in. Hark! Whose footfalls fight against the sinking, sucking mouth of the bog? And who are you? You don't look like any of those who use spark or their awakened, unawakened pawns. I'm just here for the artifacts. Ah, you and so many others before you. Their bones have made the hearth of my home, but your bones. Yes, your bones would make a fine mantle. Your intel was incorrect. You're soon flanked on all sides. The only way out is through combat. Why is this never straightforward? I'll try and let him concede. I don't think I'll be able to, but I'll try. Reduce by one whenever you play a card. At zero stacks, club a lock attacks a random enemy. Set stacks to zero whenever club a lock gets hit. Uh, you've got that as well. And you've got uh, the siphon life force equal to twice the damage they dealt, stealing it as siphoned life force. Can be spent to heal allies. Okay, so we'll kill the healer first here, I think. Just because the other ones have, like, a lot of effects that are not good for us. damage there though. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a fair hit here unfortunately. Oh never mind. Maybe not. Yeah it looks like one of the attacks was invalidated there with the uh the attack of the cobble dog. Beautiful. Oh look it's bug brain Bug brain sucks in this deck like I need to constantly play it to get past it. Well, great, and then enhance trigger maybe. Well, I can't use that. Oof. 
Almost got that second bogger down. There we go. Second one panicking. Supply targeting to club a lock this turn. Gain to overcharge seems good to me here, actually. I'm going to spend a charge gaining more actions here. Then... Apply a bunch of wounds. Yeah, and you'll want to sacrifice at the end of this turn as well. As in, like, you'll want to concede at the end of this turn. Oh, never mind. I It, it had the white flag above, but I guess... I guess we're killing. Sorry about this. Didn't really plan to do it like that. Uh, if the target is stunned, deal 15 bonus damage, expend, Swamp Smasher, Swamp Smasher, and also Bog Scimitar, heal healthy, equal to the unmitigated damage dealt by that card. That's actually really good for us. Perpetual Charger gets upgraded. Uh, it's now at the start of each turn in game two overcharge. Wild. Choose one of three battle cards. All attacks are piercing until the end of your turn. Mm, I don't really care about that. If the target is stunned, deal 15 bonus damage. Expand. Destroy it to two uses. I don't stun targets is the thing. I'm going to leave him. As the fight ends, Fleckfus walks up to confront you. What are you doing here? Making... Wait, what's Fleck... Making sure you do your job. Fleckfus gestures at your robots. Good. You didn't break your toys. I'll take those back now. So the weapons are somewhere else. My people will sniff around and see if they can pick up the bogger's trail. You can leave now. Well, at least nothing bad happened. You notice long before you reach the drop point that someone is here before you and likely they're still lying in wait. Seems you'll have to draw them out if you want an introduction. You make yourself look preoccupied and, make, and sure enough, your guests reveal themselves. Should have known you weren't worth your weight in peace. You should be so hard on yourself, Aaron. All your slick talk and mustache twirling. Felimo might think he has you under heel, but I know a far can. Uh, I know how far a spy can be trusted. You've stolen our dirty little secrets long enough. Time to turn you into one. It's a proof of weaknesses, because Arun uh, Arun likes me. You sure this is how you want to proceed? I'm a spy after all. I'm trying to look for weaknesses. Uh, whenever a weakness argument is destroyed, you gain a powerful battle for the ins uh, powerful card for the ensuing battle. After gaining four battles, the negotiation ends. Four cards remaining. Got it. Uh, no. Initial. I'll play my Admiralty Intel here, actually. Uh, blind spot, a telegraphed, and dependent. Got it. We'll start with the first one then. So Gab goes over there. It'll play itself three times. Bunch of doubt out on the field. Nice. No defense for me that turn, unfortunately, though. Oof, baby. Boosted headbang, baby. So much damage. Yeah, I'm gonna double play this boosted head bang. Gamble. Set the coin to heads, and we're all good. 
We'll take a little bit of damage here, but it's okay. And there we go. One. First, let's draw yeah, we'll three cards, I think. Okay, we need to prepare another card. Specifically, the boosted jargon. So they can actually start getting bonuses here. Brain Gills, I mean, Brain Gills does nothing, right? Draw a card and prepare a card, because I might get a free card, Nate. We did. Brain Gills does nothing to Bluff because Bluff already levels up. Playing it there. I'd love to Brain Gills the, uh, the head split this turn. That'd actually be incredible for us. Shame we can't. Dang, all that defense went to the voice of the people rather than me. I wanted to go for the voice of the meeple. Negotiation, start the fight. No, oh, fine. Okay, at least I defended myself that turn. I'm gonna stutter and mirrored call it. Giving me the ability to use boosted dilemma. Nice. Not half as convincing as you think you are? Yeah, I'm at least a couple times more convincing than that. Gamble. Damage to wall. Love it. Pair a card. Boosted gab plays three times now. Unfortunately, it defends me zero times. Should I, I should end this battle like real soon now. I'm, I'm gonna start taking some serious damage like right now. Making the enemy way too impatient for this fight. Three, two, draw one. Great, put the boost jargon in the front. This might actually still be enough to defend me this turn. I do have a rigged head, so it's defense. More heads for later, thank you. Ability to prepare a card. There we go. Draw a card, prepare a card. We'll prepare the boosted jargon. That'll also trigger the boosted gab. Let's rig a head as well before I crown rush and all myself. Gamble twice. Gamble twice more. That's going to end the battle, isn't it? Yeah. Exact damage, well done. Damn it, Aaron. <laughs> oh well, at least I still upgrade my bluff. Visionary, spotty, for visionary. Yep, cool. Can you still hear the lambs, Aaron? Can I still hear the what? I think you've wasted enough of my time. Let's get this over with. Hey, Grog, you here with me? You opened the fight by hitting me? Rude. 
Uh, two weakness blind spots and a weakness for evasion. Got it. You've got uh, one defense each the first time you take damage each turn. Yeah, just a bunch of HP. That makes sense. Bog brain. I need to get rid of it. It's now funky, fu uh, funky, fungi. Upgrade all cards in your hand for the rest of the combat. Take uh, so it's, we've seen this one before. I have nothing to upgrade, but I, d I do eventually want to get that out of the deck. But at least it's not crippling me, so I don't need to deal with it right now. I can save it for like a, a, a like an easier fight. Charged up. Chess piece is powered and ready to fire. And I guess I just got to defend for this then. What I actually should have done there is started with a promoted searing bullet, definitely. Would have been way more damage. It's my bad. So I evaded that attack. Just defend myself as best I can this turn. Strange Chemical. Chest Cannon deals four bonus damage while it's in hand, and you just put a bunch of those into my hand. That's rude. Twenty-eight to thirty-eight damage with the Spark Cannon. Yep. And I'll blind spot you as well. Well, actually, I only have the ability to use the RPG this turn, so... Yep, that'll kill instantaneously. Didn't have a choice whether I killed there or not, apparently. Uh, remove all of the opponent's intent. That's ridiculous. It's only expend as well! Holy heck! Uh, deal 1 to 4 damage. Gamble once per unmitigated damage dealt. Neat. Uh, ga uh, da gain 1 damage every time you gamble, wherever this card is. Damage reset when played. That's actually what we want. Cash out, baby. Yes, baby. That's good, baby this oh remove expand as well oh yes definitely cash out uh spend all charge gain two temporary power for each charge spent ability at the end of your turn gain one counter per charge yes. remove a random debuff from target enemy gain one action i don't debuff my enemies much i do have a the the mark debuff getting applied to him at the start of the turn but i do want to keep that on them you feel a pang as you hide the body. This is one death that won't go unnoticed, no matter how easily it might sink beneath the muck. A lone figure is loitering by the side of the road. Hey pal, you got uh, any shield for an out of work labor? I'm real hungry, the barons aren't hiring today. Here you go. Hey, go get yourself cleaned up. Wow, really? You're right, you know that. You haven't need anything, just ask. Heavy lifting at the start of each battle, gain four uh, power and uh, four defense and two temporary power. That's actually really good for us on turn one. Um, I'm gonna go to the black market and see if there's anything I can do with all this money. That's what we say. Let's look at negotiation graphs. Memorization implant at the start of each combat. Choose a card in your hand. Duplicated cards your own until play. That sounds great to me. When you play three, manipulate cards in a turn. Deal four damage to a random enemy argument. Or yeah, we'll go for the memorization implant. Shanta. Let's also add a yeah return to the last hand and rest we're about to rest at the end of the day so i'm gonna add another combat slot 
What combat grass are there? Whenever you gain fully charged, reduce the cost of a random card in hand by one. Let's get that too. That sounds good. Uh, actually, hang on. Did I... Yeah, I got rid of as many cards as I can. Okay. Now we're going to be going to rest. Yep. It calls you. Baby. Ooh, one person hates me. Oh, sucks. I don't like it. But, lot of graphs. The moment, my name is Ben Rhapsody, the name of the game has been Grifflin. So hopefully you've been enjoying yourselves and hopefully we'll see you next time.